So what do you guys want for dinner tonight? Chinese? Pizza? Sushi? I'm thinking something new. How about Thai food? I can barely tie my shoes, let alone Thai food. What? Order me two horse eggs, boiled hard. Does anybody else have any recommendations? Do any restaurants have pants on your menu? No. I had an accident in my pants at a Chili's in 1994. What? But you don't even wear pants. And now you know why. What? Obviously, we can't agree on where to eat. If only there was some way we could decide. Well, how about this? We can vote. Everybody take one paper and one pen in front of you and write down where you think we should eat. Four seconds later. Mm -hmm. What is pen? Mm. Mm -hmm. Now put your votes in this hat and we'll see what wins. I'm so excited. Okay, one vote for Thai food. That one's me. And one vote for TJ Maxx. What? Guys, we have to pick food places, not clothes stores. What? I need pants. Hmm, what size are you? 3T, boot cut, tapered in the bottom. What? This one says Heinz tomato ketchup. What? 57 varieties, net weight 14 ounces. Steve. Did you just copy what it said on the ketchup bottle right there? Is it too late to change my vote to TJ Maxx? No. Uh, at this rate, we are never going to decide. Here, why don't you guys just let me pick? That's not fair. Why should you have all the power? All right, well, how about we divide the power equally? Like the branches of government. Branches of what now? The branches of government. Yeah, they're different sections of the government. There's the judicial. <laughs> legislative. <laughs> And TJ Maxx. <laughs> no. And executive. All three of them have separate powers, but are all kind of equal. And they all work together to make the rules that the country follows. Yeah. Well, what does each branch 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 do? Well, let's start with the legislative. The legislative branch is made up of the Congress, and Congress is made up of the U.S. Senate and the U.S. House of Representatives. Each state has two senators, which means there are 100 senators in total. In the House of Representatives, there are 435 representatives. We decide this number based on each state's population. Basically, if you have a lot of people, you have a lot of representatives. For example, New Jersey, my home state, has 12 representatives, while Nebraska, which is Nebraska has only three representatives. This is because Nebraska's population is just under 2 million, while New Jersey's population is well over 9 million. Together, the Senate and the House of Representatives make up the legislative branch, and their job is to make our nation's laws. This legislative branch, they make the laws? Yeah. Like what? Like the Clean Water Act, which helps keep rivers and lakes clean from pollution. Yeah. Or the Endangered Species Act, which protects animals that are in danger of becoming extinct. Ah! Oh, like the law that says you're not allowed to take a number two in the toilets on display at Home Depot. Especially the ones in the box. What? How about I, uh, just explain the next branch? Next is the executive branch. The executive branch of our government is made up of the president, the vice president, and a group of helpers for the president called his or her cabinet. This branch is in charge of making sure that the laws of the United States are obeyed or followed. Now remember how we told you how the legislative branch makes the laws? Well, the president, who's in charge of the executive branch, has the power to sign a law which means like make it an actual law, or to veto a law, which means to reject it. Wait, how did you know so much about that branch? It was on the back of the ketchup bottle. I have idea for new law. What is it? Why forklift and no spoon lift? Surely spoon is more effective to lift things. Yeah. He's got a point. No! I have spoon. Okay, so to recap, 
the legislative branch makes the laws. And the executive branch makes sure that people follow them. So what's next? The judicial branch. This one is kind of the easiest to remember. Why's that? Well, when I was a kid, I always thought that the word judicial kind of sounds like the word judge. And this branch is made up of mostly judges and courts. Here, let me explain. So the judicial branch is full of judges, and judges are a part of the court system. This branch includes many courts, but the highest of them all is the Supreme Court. The judicial branch's job is to make sure that the laws and actions of the other two branches agree with the U.S. Constitution, which is a document that basically outlines the rules of the United States. I think I get it now. Well, that's great. This legislative branch can make a law, like don't go number two in the Home Depot toilets. I guess so, yeah. And the executive branch makes sure people follow the laws, like the guy who banned me from every Home Depot in the tri-state area. Yeah, technically. And the judicial branch would be like the regional manager of Home Depot, who decides whether or not people should poop in their display toilets especially the ones in the box. Wow, you're actually getting it, Steve. And like we said before, all three branches have equal power and work together to keep each other in check. The whole reason we have these branches is for something commonly called checks and balances. The point of checks and balances was to make sure no one branch had more power than the other, and it created a separation of powers. For example, the legislative branch makes the laws. But the president, who's part of the executive branch, has the power to veto or reject these laws. Or the judicial branch can come along and say, Hey, those laws don't line up with the Constitution, so get rid of them. Basically, they all keep each other in check and balance each other out. So there you have it. Checks and balances. So how about we use these three branches idea to decide where... Hey, where'd everybody go? Soggy left, and Andy went to bed. Steve, did you wet the bed again? Yup, and I gave it plenty of light too. What? So it should grow to be a big, healthy plant. No. I don't think that's how it works. But where did Soggy go? I wonder if they have toilets on display. Hey, teachers and parents, I have a fun little matching activity that goes along with this video. It's for sale on my Teachers Pay Teachers site. I highly recommend it. There's a link in the description box. Also, as always, there's a super secret hidden coupon code in this video. <laughs> Try to find it. If you do, you can use it to get a few bucks off of my merch, so good luck. Now on to my favorite group of people on the planet, my patrons on Patreon. They help fund these videos and keep this channel going. And if you want to get your name in my video, like them, there's a link in the description box for that too. Special thanks to Aria Caudry, Toothless and Light Fury, Connor Higgins, Lizzie Dean and Trevor, Silas M, Lava Liam, Jack and his awesome dad, Sunshine Sparkle and the Pups, Connor Pendergrass, Rebecca Beanie, Asher Evans, Wesley C, Kendall H, Benjamin M, Sammy Osif, Andrea Clark, George, George Monkey, Summers, Owen Pickle Symer, Marley and Lennon Kimsey, Oshi, Stephen McPhee, Julian Jackson and Jacob, John Michael M and Charlie M, Kathan and Callan, Burning Wick, Gavin Meidel, Lennon McCotnip Jones Page, Avalon and Cash, Jonathan George Chesselton Kent, Jasper Source Rex, Anna Axel, Catalina Ryan from Dublin, Ireland, Layla Delgado, Riker Smith, Xavier Freeze, Laser Rosen, Sophie and Remy Keffer, The Gowdy Bros and Mabsy, Kuchan115, Asher Machado, Owen Backer, Ronan X and Raiden Z, Lawrence from Canada, Sam B and his mom from Tennessee, Carter Levi and Fletcher Crawford, Solomon Caldwell and Asa Caldwell, The Rivard Boys, Roman and Mars, Bert, Kate, Ross, Lindy and Pepper, Jackson Bear Welch, Carter Levi and Fletcher Crawford, Roman Kennedy, Gavin and Hayden Huggin, Hawthorne and Willow Tree, Penny and Liam Drury, Gavin and Ian Eshte, Erickson and Alexander L, Virginia and Harrison Way, Jason the Kid Parker, Gregory Shaw, 
CL and Django Henry, Evan Lee, Charlie Stone, Luke Raposa, JJ Schmidt, Ellie Moon and Noah Orion, Alexander, Julian and David, Max and Kaz, Liam, Basil and Louie, Christopher F, Bodie Turner, The Puffin Boys, Ben and Ollie, Jonah Joyce, Callum G, Lainey, Maddie and Henry, Connor Lecoque and family, Connor and Emma B, Sam and Eddie from London, Jameson, Nolan and Lily, Zane and Asher Davis, John Arthur and Alice, Ada S, Lucia and Camilla Buendia, Paisley, Hanalei, Whitney and Brian, Liam and Evelina, Max C, Lucas Willette and family, Jack Hartzler, Mika, Jordan and Maya. If you want your name in my next video, you should sign up to my Patreon too. It's pretty cool. Just visit patreon.com backslash Mr. DeMeo, sign on up, and I'll put your name in my next video. Thanks for watching, guys.